First at 10, remembering a beloved UCF student killed in a motorcycle crash in Volusia County. Family members tell us the victim who died was 22-year-old Nicholas Thomas. He was supposed to graduate from college this December, and as West Shoes Christina Watkins tells us, he had dreams of becoming a pilot and worked every day to bring joy to many across Central Florida. Nice to meet you. My name's Nick Thomas. Yeah, so <laughs> just messing with y'all. 22-year-old Nicholas Thomas brought that laughter, that smile everywhere he went, especially here on the mat and on the sidelines as a cheerleader for the University of Central Florida. <laughs> While passionate about the sport, spending many days competing and coaching, Nick's mom says his heart was always up in the sky. Every day since he was a little kid, he worked toward becoming a commercial pilot. It's a dream his instructor John Roush helped with, pushing him to get his pilot's license in 2017. He said Nick was one of his favorite students at the Aviation Academy in Sebring. And following him through the years and seeing him develop into that type of a young man, uh, it, just, it just broke me up to see that taken away in a heartbeat. Nick was called home Tuesday morning around 3 o'clock. He was riding his beloved motorcycle on I-4 in Deltona when he got into a crash and died. Roush was one of the first people Nick's mom called to relay the heartbreaking news. She said, uh, Nick's is not going to be a pilot. And that was the, one of the first things she said to me. And, I, and I'm thinking, okay, what, you know, what didn't he do or what, you know, physical didn't he pass? I mean, I didn't know. And then she said, um, he got killed yesterday, and, and that's, I lost it. Roush says this loss is difficult to process. He described Nick as a bright light, a hardworking and loving son, brother, friend, who brought joy to everyone. I just felt so helpless and sad and angry. He had everything ahead of him. Loved ones say they will carry on his life following a motto Nick lived by himself. Stay hungry, humble, and quiet. There is a lot that Nick gave us that he can continue to give us if we just listen to the message. Christina Watkins, WESH 2 News. A UCF cheer posted this tribute to Nick on Instagram saying in part, Nick never met a stranger and loved connecting with fans. He was a devoted son, a dedicated teammate, and loved coaching the many youth and high school cheerleaders in our community. His love for UCF was second only to his love for his family. He'll be deeply missed. Fly high, Nick Thomas. We love you.